Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome on back to another episode of Nick Reviews Anything. I'm Nick, and I review anything. And you probably just heard, like I start off every video. This guy, you know, old Ripley. You're going to hear him panting in the background. There's not much I can do. It's Mr. Ripley. And he's going to go up on the bed. Yeah. Oh, I have to help him. I have to help him. Hang on. Let me put this down. Oh, yeah, he's an old guy. What are you going to do? All right. Anyway, back to the video. Um, today's video, I have... TP-Link wireless adapter dongle whatever you want to call it. Um, it's for my desktop computer. I'm going to probably move it out of this room into another room, and I don't feel like running a running the Ethernet cord to the other room, and it's not wireless adaptable. No, it doesn't have a wireless card in it. So I bought this guy to turn it into a wireless computer. So maybe... You have an old computer laying around and you don't want to run the Ethernet cord. Figured I'll give this a shot and see what you guys think. See what I think of it. And we'll go from there. Um, so this video is kind of going to be unboxing because this is new. And I'm going to put it on. See how quick it works. See if it works good. So let's get into it. Now I got this thing from Target. It was 30 bucks. 30 bucks for this dude. Okay. Get out of here. I'm thinking this isn't uh, too hard. Too hard to install. Trying to do this one handed is not easy. There we go. Let's pop it out. So I figured 30 bucks, it's worth a shot. It's better than trying to drill holes in the floor or running the stupid cord to another room, which is just usually a pain. All right, what do we got? We have wireless adapter. We got a CD. Can't possibly need that, does it? There we go. This little dude. All right. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to unplug all the internet from this computer, which is right there. And let's make sure it's not loading. Let's load Firefox. And let's do ESPN. Why not, right? There we go. No internet. So let's open this up. these all right I'm just gonna plug it into a front USB because I don't feel like digging around in the back let's do this you heard it click all right let's see if it's working wonder if it's actually gonna make me put the CD in no, well, maybe it is actually going to make me put the CD in. Let's look at the quick startup guide here. Alright, let's see. Directly, yes. Now, oh, it is actually going to make me put the CD in. Well, it says install driver. So... Oh, here we go. I'm going to put that in. I can go to the website. You can go to the website and download the driver, but right now I don't have internet, so... Um, www.tplink.com slash download dash center. I'll put that um, in the video. But since I already unplugged the internet, let's just put the CD in. Old school. Old school style. Let's open this. Can't believe it actually has this. All right. 
let's do this. Let it run. Download the driver. Waiting. 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 Oh, here we go. There we go. There we go. Auto run. Yes. There we go. First select the model. It's the only one. Do, do, do. Waiting. 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 Is verifying the installer. Seventy percent, seventy-five percent, and again, I'm not sure in what order my videos are going to come out, but um, I'm actually replacing this computer with a laptop, and I already have the new laptop, and I'm going to do a review on that laptop, the HP Victus. Um, this video will probably come out before the final of that video, so. Anyway, if you're interested in a laptop video, subscribe to the channel and um, click the notifications and uh, it'll be on there when I get to it. Uh, but I'm, I just got the laptop and I wanted to use it for about a month before I um, post the final review of it. So, that being said, I'm going to wait for this thing to install and then uh, we'll come on back. So, hang on a second. Okay, driver is installed. Now you connect your computer to a Wi-Fi network. Okay. Yeah, the WPS button. Uh, no. Let's try to do this. Oh, here we go. Here are my networks. I have the Netgear and I have the Aris. Let's just do the Netgear because I know that password. All right, let's type it in. Okay. Verifying and connecting. Oops. Must have typed it in wrong. Try it again. Sure, why not? Okay. There it is, connected, secured. So let's see. Let's go back. Go back to. Oh, yeah, look at that. ESPN. There it is. So this little dude works. The other idea of this was that. Um, if your wireless card in your laptop or computer is old or it doesn't have good range, this thing is supposed to have increased range for your wireless um, network. And it's kind of big. This thing kind of acts as like an antenna on there. So, yeah, I don't know how far it's supposed to go based on your other ones. But, yeah, this thing, uh, you know, loads fast. Yeah, good to go. Let's go to, uh, let's go to eBay. Let's try that. That, there it is, loads up fast. Yeah, look at that. So yeah, works really good. All right, I like this. This saved a ton of time because, you know, if you've ever run cords underneath your floor to a different room, what a pain in the you-know-what. So, yeah, I mean, if you're looking for something that's simple and easy to install, I mean, geez, this, this took, this video is running 10 minutes and most of it's just me talking. So this took five minutes to get set up and running. This is great. 30 bucks. No drilling holes in the floor. No worrying that your Ethernet cord isn't long enough to get from your, your router to your computer. Yeah, turn anything into a wireless computer. Got an old desktop laying around, but you want to put it in a different room? This, get this guy. Yeah, I'll put the link to the listing, um, the Target listing in the description as well. So, yeah. What do you think? I think that was pretty good. That was easy. Took two seconds, you know? I put the CD in, but again, you don't have to have a CD drive to install this. Um, 
There's a URL in the instructions. You can go online, download the driver there, and yeah. So don't worry about if you have an old computer that doesn't have a CD drive on it. You don't need that. Um, I'll put the uh, the driver URL in the description of the video. So simple video, guys. Yeah, this, you can't go wrong with this. Five minutes tops. Turn your old computer into a wireless computer. Good stuff. Anyway, short video today. Um, you know the drill. Like, share, subscribe. Ask me questions. I got all kinds of other review videos out there. Sling TV, Fire Stick. I've got some dog stuff reviews, clothing reviews. You know, I mean, I'm just trying to see what you guys like. So let me know if you like what you see. Leave a comment. Um, if you got anything else you want me to review that I might have, I'm always game for that. But anyway, thanks for listening to me and, uh, appreciate you tuning in and, uh, yeah, see what I come up with next. Have a good one guys. Peace.